Good morning, I'm Zach Youngberg with NDEM News. We now have additional news on that devastating 7.2 earthquake that struck this morning near Elko, Nevada. Live at the scene in Elko is our field correspondent, Paul Burke, with the very latest. Paul, what can you tell us? Good morning, Zach. This morning, a magnitude 7.2 earthquake hit the eastern Nevada community of Elko. It was followed by a strong 6.0 aftershock just 15 minutes or so. Both of these events have resulted in a number of both fires, damage to infrastructure, and at least two injuries have been reported at the local hospital here. I'm told the cause of this fire here is unknown, but most likely it's going to be something as a result of the earthquake, either a ruptured gas line or something of that nature. Fire crews have been on the scene at this fire since about 9 a.m. Apparently there was a problem at the fire station with the doors being damaged from the earthquake. Uh, we're getting reports from all over Elko about damages to structures and also to the utilities. Paul, have you heard anything about the impact on homes or businesses in the Elko area or what officials are doing to respond to the event? Yes, Zach, at the moment it's pretty difficult to gauge the exact impact of the event, but a shelter has been opened by the American Red Cross here in Elko at Adobe Middle School. This is for anyone who can't stay at their residence or can't shelter in place. Um, state officials are already talking to us about providing additional resources if necessary to the local uh, to the local agencies. Officials are cautioning the public to stay in place, shelter in place as much as they can. If they have to travel, they recommend the public avoid any damaged structures or roadways and be cautious of downed power lines. Uh, reporting live from the scene at the fire, this is Paul Burke for NDEM News. Thank you, Paul, for all of that important information. I'm Zach Youngberg with NDEM News, and please stay tuned for more information.